This local sports report is presented by the Guelph Minor Lacrosse Association, providing a memorable experience for players in all age divisions. Come out this summer and cheer on the Regals at home and on the road. Learn more about their box and field programs by visiting GuelphRegalsLacrosse.com. It's opening day at the Chuck Miller Lacrosse Classic in Guelph. This is U13 action. The Guelph Regals playing in their first game of the tournament on Friday afternoon. They would face off with the Sarnia Pacers. Jumping into the first period and it's the Pacers striking first on this play. Price Taft cuts inside and buries the opener. And the Pacers wouldn't stop there. Only moments later now and it's more from Sarnia. It's a great lockdown check from Ian Hedrick. He steals the ball and charges back the other way. Ian spots out Dane Mainland out front, and Dane makes it 2-0 early in this one. The Regals back the other way looking to answer. It's a great inside pass from Adam Schauble. He spots out James Osborne, and James finishes it. So the Regals cut the Pacers lead in half. Back come the Pacers and watch the setup from Andrew Watson. He feeds Colton Kennedy back door, and Colton makes it 3-1 for the Pacers. The Pacers moving the ball well, and they keep the pressure coming. Ian Hedrick lobs an underhanded pass to Dane Mainland, and Dane's got a pair. That's a nice setup from Sarnia, and we head to the second, 4-1 Pacers. In the second now, and it's the Pacers picking up where they left off here on a power play. Link Gavigan spots out Emmett Stevenson on an inside run, and Emmett makes it 5-1. Later on that same power play, and it's the Pacers converting again. Breyer Vanderberg sends it 5-hole, and it's 6 for Sarnia. The Regals still battling hard and watch the solo effort from Adam Schauble. He turns on the Jets in the neutral zone, cuts back inside and shoots, and Adam, that's a beauty! So the Regals are at two, heading to the third. In the third now and back from the Pacers, Ian Hedrick picks up the loose ball and rips it on net, and Ian Hedrick, that's a snipe show! So it's 7-2 Sarnia. Later in the period now, 8-2 Pacers, the Regals looking to fire back. Watch the speed from Brody McKnight. He's alone on net. Lucas Brower, stones of cold. The Regals coming close, but it's the Pacers striking again. Andrew Watson fires a bullet to the goal mesh, and it's 9-2. Late in the third now, and here's the silver lining for Guelph. Reed Garrard fires a low shot on net. James Osborne slams in the rebound. So the Regals make it three for themselves as this one comes to an end. So a good battle, but in the end, it's the Sarnia Pacers coming out on top. They take it over the Guelph Regals by a final score of 9-3 on Friday afternoon at the Chuck Miller Classic.